Hello guys, welcome to the video, and today, I'll be playing some Loom of Legacy, and the new other finally came, as you can see, Street Retreat. Yes, and I'm gonna be playing this, I mean, I played it off camera, it was really cool, so I came to show you guys some um, tips and tricks about it, how to get new lumens and new roaming, especially the roaming, ooh, the roaming is really cool, and I like the roaming, ooh. Alright, and now let's get started on this today's video. And yes, I like Sweet Retreat. It's a really fun play. Whoa. Oh, my skin changed. No, wait. No, my skin even changed. That's weird. Oh, I was to keep it like that. So, here is the new roaming right here. I can't really pronounce the name, but I'm gonna try saying it. Nightmare? Yeah? I don't know. It's a... I don't think... But it's really hard. I did trade it this with someone else, so this is what it looks like. Here are the base stats. I can't really show you the base stats, but you can see what it would be looking like. And uh, here are the some of the uh, here are some of the attacks. So I put hypnotize here, but right here is usually a tail whip. So yeah, it's a normal type move. So yeah, so. This is how you get the roaming, new roaming. So, okay, I'll show you the cry. All right, that's the cry. So here's how you get it. So first, you need to do all these stuff. So here, so for example, if I do this, it says shows here that right here in this uh, sticky note, it shows that the 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 batter the batter icing and topping. So the topping, you want to put this side. So right here is the topping, the, the icing, this is where you bake, this is where you put the bread thing. So here, so right now I'm in the topping area, so I put topping, I put the so topping strawberry. I'm gonna grab the strawberry, so all you gotta do is press this, and the strawberry's there, and there, I got one cake point. So yes, if I, if I don't, if you guys don't get it, then go watch another video tutorial, but this is not gonna be it's just con just showing you guys. So you just have to do this simple, you know. Only gives you one point each. This is uh, cherry, the cherry here, and there we go. So, so if so, once it goes through through here, it puts a box over here. So and then once it goes to the customers, like the if you did the work and then it goes to the customers, they'll give you like more points, so like like five or. Six. Look here, see? I got four points. I got four points. We giving it to her, and now I got seventeen. So yeah, see again. So I don't know if you guys understand me, but I don't know how to say it. But I hope you guys understand what I'm trying to say. So here, so yeah, that's basically it. So that's how you get it on cake points. So you guys are like saying, how do you get cake? How do you use? How do you spend these cake points? How do I use them? Pretty simple. So this is the boss guy. He talked to him. He's going to say like dialogue and stuff. He will actually tell you the stuff to do. But yeah. So you tap on him. And say how he's going. If you want to exchange K points for goodies. So this is what it is. The one you want to get 200 points. K points. You take this. You buy it. I don't have enough. See. But you buy this. And then you go over here. To this this um thing this pot here i'll show i'll go run here so right now i don't have a cake yet but if i put it on here the roaming it'll show that cutscene the roaming just going down here and then you'll put it into a battle with her or he whatever does roaming does roaming have their own gender probably not but whatever so whatever uh gender it is so it's gonna show this and you gotta battle it so but this is different than the other ones you can't softly sweat it i mean you can but you're gonna lose a cake and the counter so that means if you um you said i trying to get a gleaming gamma or a secret figure ability you're probably not going to have you probably have to like keep on um, like getting 200 points every time so let's say you want to softly swear sir, this uh, 15 times, so you need to get like a lot of cake points, like I mean a lot, just for a gaming gamble, I say whatever. So yeah, that's how it works for this new roaming. 
lightning lash. It is a pretty good on Roman. And it's gonna say a range attacker. See, it's mostly a range attacker. So I recommend you uh, if you're going to be using um, using this, I recommend you uh, be, um, using only range attack moves. Because if you use um, melee move, I mean melee attack moves, it won't really have that much effect because I only have two points for that. So yes, but, but anywhere else though, stats are really good. Now it's time for the rest of the Lumions. So, so uh, I mean I don't have all of it, but I will show you some of them because I haven't discovered them all of it. So here with Pubia. So I don't really have that much, but here's the first one. A point. This Lumion is a one in fifteen chance to find in the grass. And if I try to go here, no. Um, this is this Lumion I'm talk about later, but well, this Lumion also has three different colors, so that's fun fact about it. All right, so a point. Can it, it can't evolve by level. It can only evolve by a certain uh, item. So go to this guy right here, click on him, and you will see birthday candle, 300 points. So it's kind of like the Halloween update, winter update, whatever that update. It has always have those only has it always have like one Lumion that can evolve with an item. So the birthday candle is the one you want to get 300 cake points. You need to grind for that. Once you have that, give it to Kapoing, and it will evolve into. Uh, I forgot the name of it, but you guys will discover it. I'm just showing you um, how to, to do these, and it is really good, I'm just saying, because I have a point, because if I say this, so that you won't know what, so I won't spoil the evolution for this. Alright, so, so next we have, uh, Ma Mo Mochopi? Mochop? Mochop? Machopi? I'm not- I don't know if I'm saying it right, but this Lumion is a, a Lumion that you can find. It has three different colors. It has the red, it has the pink, yellow, and green. And oh yeah, and by the way, fun fact, the gleamings will show- the gle if you have the gleaming one of these, the face inspections will look different for gleamings. Well anyways, so it evolves out of that, it evolves to um, this Lumion. Tome Chi, Tome, Tome, Tome Mochi, Tome Mochi. I think I'm saying that right. And it evolves, I think level, I don't know, level 14 something. But usually just level up once or twice, and then you get this Lumion. And it is an okay Lumion, really sugar rush. The no, training, eh? I mean, if you want to get PVP, oh yeah, my way, you can rally these. So you don't have to grind to get. So no more grinding just to find a uh, corrupted and then killing it just to get shards. You can just rally these. Really actually kind of helpful even with this. And yeah. Wow. Next one I have uh next one, the next Lumion. I think I might be the last one, but I'll show it to you. At the mastery Wikipedia. And it's right here, the worm. So this Gaworm, you can find it anywhere. It's it's not I don't want to say common, but mostly it's a unique uh, Guilumian to find in the grass area. Only in Secret Sheep. So if we go here, there Gaworm. It's not hard to get. So yeah, I can catch one of these, you know, or kill or whatever. So yeah, you kill Gaworm and it'll just yeah, you just catch Gaworm, you have it. So the evolution is kind of like the previous Lumion that I showed you. So you can, if you level up once or twice, you'll you'll get this Lumion right here. Uh, Odd Azo, Odd Azo, Odd Azo. I guess I'm saying it right. I'm not sure, but for some reason, I feel like this Lumion is a Halloween Lumion. Has it? It's candy, spooky eyes, whatever. Just saying. But it evolves to this, and it's supposed to be a cocoon of Lumion. Yeah, so it has these uh, moves, spirit, um, bug bite, yes. And its ability is hard candy. So yeah, this is the evolution. And the last evolution, I don't actually have it, but it's a butterfly. 
which is really cool because that's the first Lumiere that actually looks like a butterfly than Cinemoth. Cinemoth, it's a moth, but not butterfly. So, yeah. Oh yeah, and by the way, Fan Cup doesn't have a, a evolution yet. So yeah, that's basically all I have for today's video. And I'll show you that yeah, actually we can rally these. So if I go to um, adventure mode, Let's see. They'll allow me to go to adventure mode. If you go to Rally Ranch, you can actually rally these, like I said. So I'm gonna see if it works. I might make a mistake. So this is the third evolution for uh, Mochubi, whatever that is. It usually has. Um, this is what it looks like. It's actually really cool. That's what I'm trying to get. This one right here. I'm trying to evolve it to that. But, anyways, uh, if we go to Rally. Rally Ranch. Uh, let's see. Okay, hurry up. I want to show these people the stuff. Alright. So once you go here, you can talk to this guy and you can actually rally these. You know, get these out of here. Uh, yes, okay. Draw to whatever. So you can actually rally these. See? Even though the events, you can rally these. I don't know if this is like they did it on purpose or an accident, but you can actually rally all of these. Like, look at this. Of course, not their new roaming. It, of course, no. You can uh, never rally roamings. Yes, so you can just do this, you know? Just do whatever you want with these, even in Kapoink. Yeah, that was usually the ones. So, yeah. So, that's basically it for the video. And yes, it's actually kind of a really fun video to make and how my reaction was to the new update. Of course, you guys didn't see my reactions off, off camera because the, the new update was like on 10 o'clock, literally. And I didn't really like that because I have to go to bed, you know, reasons at school and stuff, you know. But it's alright, at least I get to have, at least I, have, I guess to play these. So if you guys want to see me play more of these, um, more of these, um, Lumen Legacy updates, make sure to like and subscribe, comment, um, which Lumen should I, which, which Lumen should I use in battle, but not PvP, because obviously, I don't have a P, I don't, I don't really have any PvP ones, or well, I'm just lazy. Actually, I think I have PvP one, I think I can use that for my Lumen's, but anyways, if you guys enjoyed the video, like and subscribe, and yes, and that's it for this video, and yes, I just screenshot it, but whatever. Peace!